How are we doing? So I just got to show you this really quickly. It's a cool for all the WordPress geeks out there. It's a cool little plugin that I just found. Uh, I'll show you where I found it. And it does this as you scroll down. Look at the right hand side of the screen. My join me on Facebook uh, box there pops up and as I keep scrolling it stops and it fills in that blank space because you don't want to fill up the side of your blog with loads and loads of stuff you just want the key things to come up kind of above the fold but then when you scroll down it's always blank so uh, as you scroll down this one stays there and you can put whatever you want in there um, this is where I kind of got the idea from is smart passive income Pat Flynn his is a bit cooler he's probably had a bit more custom code and played around with it a bit but as you scroll down watch that fade in how cool is that and then it stays there go down reading the blog reading the blog reading the blog it's still there all the time as you scroll back up it goes and fades back in now that is nice <laughs> but it's super easy um, I've only had a little play around with it so I'm just doing a quick video to show you what what um, plugin to use and mine just does that at the minute I don't know if I can get it to fade in or not I'll have to play around with it a bit more but um, yeah it's this it's called <sighs> It's called a sticky widget is what it's really called, but here's the plugin, Q2W3 Fixed Widget. But if you just go into the into your plugin section in WordPress and search for sticky widget, it will come up as number one and you can just install that. And here's where it's uh, here's where you use it. You know how to install a, a, a kind of a plugin already if you're a WordPress user, you just go to plugin, search for sticky widget and install it, but you won't see it anywhere because all it actually does is add a little tick box to your widgets. So we're just going to the primary sidebar, and this is my join me on Facebook box. That's the uh, the code for it, the iframe. And all it's done is add this little tick box to the widget, a little fixed widget. So all you've got to do is tick that box, click on save, then go back to your site and refresh it, and it should be it should be working. The only settings there are to look at are how high and low you want it to sit away from the top or the bottom of the screen, um, which are here in fixed widget options. I'll just click on that one and this is it that's the only settings I won't run you through each one of them they're already fairly straightforward margin top margin bottom the refresh interval and a few little tick boxes there in case you're having any issues but uh, yeah pretty straightforward plugin that does a pretty cool thing so I've played around with that for ages like other other things like how, to, how do you fill it up do you fill up your blog all the way to the bottom because when you're when you write a long blog post or any blog post it tends to you're gonna have to scroll down and it tends to leave this big blank space on the right hand side. So uh, so give it a go, that's pretty cool. Uh, a bit geeky, I like it. WordPress plugin, uh, fixed widget or sticky widget. So uh, give it a go, cheers.